Hi and welcome. In this short video, I'm going to show you how you can create a new catapult project in the Tire app in less than a minute. As you can see, I'm now inside the Tire platform and I have an active catapult subscription which we signed up for in the previous video. To create a new project, simply click on the new project button in the menu on the left hand side. First, give your project a name so that you can easily find it on your dashboard later. Then choose translation. Now define the language of your uploaded content and then choose the languages that you want your content to be translated into. You can easily add multiple languages by clicking on the language of your choice. My document is in English and I'd like to translate it to, let's say, Italian and German because these are the languages I also speak. Then I'm going to click continue. Now it's time to upload the files that I want to translate. I can upload as many as 150 files per project with a size limit of 150 megabytes per file. You can upload your project either by dragging and dropping your files or by copy pasting your text straight into the text field. Tire supports 64 different file types, anything ranging from a regular office document such as Word or Excel all the way down to very specific localization files that help you translate your websites or even subtitles. The Tire app also supports InDesign documents and PDFs. Most of these file types are going to keep the original formatting once translated. This means you won't have to spend any time editing the file after you've finished translating. However, we do recommend you uploading open file types such as Word documents instead of file types like PDFs, as this will ensure the best possible output. I'm going to go ahead and drop a Word file from my desktop and click Continue. Now it's time to select a category that best fits my project. I'm translating a blog post, which is of course marketing content. The category selection affects what kind of translation memory is being used, and it also decides which machine translation solution is going to help you translate your content. So make sure to select the appropriate category because it will affect how you work on future projects. Once I'm done, I can just click here on Create Your Project, and my project will be created. At this stage, the app is actually translating your content in advance using your existing translation memory. Our machine translation solutions are also working in the background to pre-translate your text. And here it is. Our project analysis is now finished. You can choose between translating by yourself using Catapult or outsourcing your project to Tyre's professional translators. But more about this in another video. For now, we're going to click Start Translating and head over to our Project Overview screen. Great. Our project is now ready for translation. We can see here how many words our file has. As we have a 2000 word subscription, we'll still have some words to play with after we've finished with this project. And that's it. We've successfully created a new project and now all that's left to do is start. Let's say we want to start with Italian. We can just click translate to Italian and we're ready to go. In the next video, I'll show you how to start translating through Catapult.